Hello and welcome to a new session of English Drops. Today we are going to discuss what is a discourse marker. Discourse markers are words and phrases used in speaking and writing to signpost discourse. They do this by showing turns, joining ideas together, showing attitude and generally controlling communication. And we're going to start with the scores, markers or linkers to uh, express result. So, it's usually found in a sentence linking two clauses. Consequently, therefore, and as a result, are often used at the beginning of a sentence. I know you must be tired, so I will let you rest. He spoke so well that everybody was pleased. I know I'm not much account, but I'm the only horse in all the land of Oz, so they treat me with great respect. He worked the hardest, therefore he got the promotion. I think I stay too long, therefore I'm leaving in the morning. At the hotel, we take safety very seriously and consequently we have security officers on duty 24 hours a day. Consequently, Jim is not passing his classes because he is not completing his assignments. Many local citizens died as a result of a bomb blast. Jackson misbehaved with his boss. As a result, he lost the job. A result of is a compound preposition and makes an adverbial phrase, and the beginning of a sentence is one very good place for an adverb. As a result of this mishap, he was not on work for a week. As a result, he had to leave. And this time, we're talking of a discourse marker or linker that expresses reason, okay? Because as and since introduce clauses of reason. Since and as can usually be found at the beginning of the sentence. Owing to, due to, and because of are commonly followed by the gerund, a noun, or the fact of that. First of all, I married Alex because I loved him. Is it because winning the award gives them more confidence? They were angry because their plans had been discovered. As she left the kitchen, his boys followed her. Her face warmed as she thought of it. 
As a matter of fact, I did. Since you arrived, she's not sure this is the way. It's a long time since we met, he said. In this case, we are in, uh, in presence of a uh, passive voice. It's a long time since we met, he said. I was late this morning because of the traffic. Paul moved to Paris because of his job. I cannot come because of the weather. Because of her sickness, Maria did not go to work. My fitness is due to regular exercise. The classes are due to commence in late spring of this year. The picnic was cancelled due to the fact that it was raining. I didn't attend the meeting owing to the headache. Owing to a lack of funds, the project will not continue next year. Mrs. Pratt regrets that she is unable to attend owing to a previous engagement. In the cases of so as to in order to and to, they all introduce a clause of purpose. This time, the discourse marker or linker expresses purpose, okay, and are followed always by an infinitive. I am studying very hard in order to improve my English skills. In case plus a close indicates doing something as a precaution. She kept her voice low, in case the room next door was occupied. I went to the supermarket to buy milk. She worked hard in order to pass. I studied really hard so as to pass the exam. You should take notes in case we forget some detail. Take him along just in case. In case I forget later, here are the keys to the garage. But it's very used for linking to contrasting view. This time we're talking about the scores marker or linker for expressing contrast. Okay? It is well known as the most informal and common way to make contrast. He said no more, but expressed his resignation to cruel fate by a gesture. Yet is a more formal way of expression. However, and nevertheless are located at the start of the sentence.
even though is used or you must use this even though when you want to be more emphatic the phone woke me up even though it wasn't very loud I was running home however Lucy was about to leave the house however I'm sure James does not drink so much uh, a sentence taken from Jane Austen uh, Northanger Abbey from uh, 1818 she enjoyed the beach however she forgot her cooler of beer no man knows when he shall die although he knows he must die although he's quite old he's still very active Even though they were millionaires, they drive all cars. He had a good time with his family, even though he was very busy yesterday. I like her, in spite of her failings. In spite of the bad things he's done, I still believe in his essential goodness. Thomas still loves him, despite he was abandoned by his lover. Despite they had been training for hours, they lost the football game. <laughs> Nevertheless, his administration was by no means unfruitful. <laughs> William's triumph was nevertheless complete. <laughs> nevertheless, President Trump made no effort to reform the methods of administration. <laughs> she objected at first, but finally submitted. But he was anxious to learn. He is my worst enemy and yet I admire him as the wisest man in the world. Yet, no matter how many times she tried to reassure herself of that, she remained concerned. And I don't want to finish this English drop session uh, without practicing a little bit, okay? So I'm going to show you a series of sentences used in this uh, presentation, in this video. Uh, and you will have to choose what is the best option to complete the sentence, okay? The first one, many local citizens died as a result or due to a bomb blast. Jackson misbehaved with his boss due to or as a result he lost the job. My absence from office was as a result or due to my illness. Due to or as a result the rain I will stay here. 
it is too late, so that, or in case, we cannot go to cinema. And you should take notes in case or so that we forget some detail. You can always pause this video in order for you to be able to choose uh, which of the two options will be the best, will be the correct one to complete this sentence. So in the first one, we have many local citizens died as a result of a bomb blast. At the second one, we have Jackson misbehaved with his boss. As a result, he lost the job. My absence from office was due to my illness. Due to the rain, I will stay here. It is too late so that we cannot go to cinema. And you should take notes in case we forget some details. Another one would be this, nevertheless, or as a result, the work have been done. The schools were reorganized in 1917 as a result of, or nevertheless, a survey. I know you must be tired, so, or as, I will let you rest. We cannot go on vacation to USA this year, so or as we cannot afford it. And, but in spite or due of his aggressive behavior, she felt safe with him. In the first one, the correct choice, the correct option is... Nevertheless, the work had been done. At the second one, the correct option will be The schools were reorganized in 1917 as a result of a survey. I know you must be tired, so I will let you rest. We cannot go on vacation to USA this year, as we cannot afford it. But in spite but in spite of his aggressive behavior, she felt safe with him. And well, this way we had reached to the end of this uh, session of English Drops. I hope you like it. I uh, hope you enjoy it. And please take care. And I'll see you at the next English Drop pretty soon. Bye bye.